I'm joined by Susan Sundstrom, and she's got Nordic Thunder through to the Tab Million Dollar Chase semi-finals. He's run second today behind Aston Barrick. Susan, how are you feeling? Ah, oh, I think I'm just a bit stunned. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it, and I just um, over the moon. <laughs> it's a hell of a run. I just saw you sitting in there quietly before. Were you just taking stock and just thinking about the run and what you've achieved? Oh, absolutely. I think it's just um, amazing to get through. I never thought I'd ever have a dog good enough to get that far. Yeah. We well, were just talking off camera. You haven't had a dog run in any heat, regional heat. Obviously, no regional final of the Tab Million Dollar Chase. You went to Dapto. Bit of a hard luck story there. Um, what was your thought process? You just throw him in and see how he goes? Yeah, well, he's run all right here. He has run the 2466 here. We didn't know who was going to nominate, so we thought, oh, let's go. Out comes the field, and he's right next to Shoes of Pearl. <laughs> <laughs> went, oh, but, you know, you've got, you've got to be in it to win it, so we thought, let's see what happens. Yeah, he went third last week, um, a good run, and um, just a bit better this week, obviously. Yeah. Next stop, Wenny Park. He's had a few runs in there. He won there recently as well. How do you think he'll enjoy that? Will he like the two turns better than he does down here at Goulburn? Yes, he does. He likes the two turn track. He's won at Nowra, he's won at Dapto, and he's won at Wenny Park. So he likes the two turns. He also likes the extra distance. Um, I think he's going to be a 600 dog eventually. <laughs> it's almost a year to the day. He had a pretty serious so shoulder injury. He was off the track for a bunch of months. Do you think back now to early in the year when he wasn't even racing, now you're in the, in the mix for a million bucks. How does that make you feel? Oh, that's, that's excellent. It just shows that if you spend some time with these injured dogs, even uh, severely injured dogs, that you, know, you can have some success along the way. You know? So I've got three at the moment, so I hope the others come back as good as him. <laughs> so wonderful, Susan. You can see the, the joy radiating out of you. Uh, last question. If you won a million dollars, what's the first thing you would buy? Uh, I guess if I won a million dollars, I'd probably buy both my kids a house. <laughs> <laughs> Well, well, we're pensioners now and, you know, we, we just enjoy what we do. The money's not that important. It's about the dogs and having some fun, really. They're all our breed, the whole, the whole litter. I've got the whole litter of this lot. Um, and next litter coming up very shortly, so maybe next year <laughs> as well. <laughs> well said. A proud mum, proud mum to Greyhounds and kids. Uh, congratulations. A wonderful story. All right. Thank you very much. <laughs>